Wildfire is a risk that all British Columbians uh, need to prepare for. It's, it's not a, a matter of if, it's a matter of when uh, we will all be affected by wildfire. Christina Lake is absolutely at risk uh, and, uh, of, uh, from wildfire for a number of reasons. There, of course, it can get very hot and extremely dry. Not as much as the Okanagan, but there's not a big difference there. So therefore, um, we are at risk. There are a lot of tourists and locals. Uh, not everybody is uh, um, very uh, aware of the fire risk and their behavior is accordingly. So we definitely, the residents, have to do everything we can do to uh, make sure everybody knows about this. I was deployed as a task force leader. Uh, to the Inkmeat Fire and to the White Rock Lake Fire. Uh, during the White Rock Lake Fire, uh, we were, um, it, was, it was one of the, the most aggressive wildfires we had seen in BC in 2021. Uh, we were very limited on our resources and our, our manpower. Um, we were in an area where there was several homes that were not fire smarted and we did lose uh, several structures uh, in that area. Working with uh, BC Wildfire, I was deployed into a, a, a group called an incident support group, and we were uh, there to uh, work directly with the incident, uh, the IMT, the incident management team. And uh, what we were doing was uh, strategic long-range planning for for the fire, because of the uh, complex nature of that fire and how many communities that were impacted. So we were looking at long-range planning from the 10 to 30 day range. Um, resource needs, how it would impact communities, evacuations. Um, I, I like to think that it was uh, new work that we were doing that was really uh, provided the incident management team uh, with additional information to, to base their decisions on and the response to the incident on. Structure protection specialists, um, they will go into the properties uh, before uh, the wildfire uh, comes into the, the neighborhood and they will triage the property and then they'll come up with a structure protection plan for each home. The structure protection crews will then assist in setting up our wildfire sprinklers and protecting the neighborhoods uh, for wildfire. This is the RDKV's uh, sprinkler protection trailer. Uh, the RDKV has two units. One is stationed here in Christina Lake but the other trailer stationed in Trail. Each trailer is equipped with enough sprinklers to protect approximately 30 homes. We have uh, several pumps inside, bladders to hold our water, and, and a few thousand feet of hose as well. Structure protection units can be deployed throughout the province using trailers like this to protect our homes. Head to firesmartbc.ca to check out the countless resources, including downloadable guides on how to become more fire smart.